Hi, my name's Andres Abeta, Director of Bootcamp GIS. We really take a hard look at seeing what industry is asking for and matching education with the needs of students. If you're in college or near finishing, I bet you have this feeling, am I prepared to get a job? You might not know about something called the skills gap. It's the gap between what you are learning and what you'll be asked to do in industry. We found this really apparent when we looked at the classes offered by university programs and we compared them to the skills being asked for on job announcements. Don't get me wrong, both of my kids are in college and I want them to get a degree. But I also advise them, and any student that we talk to, take a hard look at other sources of technical education to enhance your portfolio and improve your chances of getting a job. So what are the skills that make you more marketable? You don't have to be a GIS rocket scientist to see that the world revolves around harnessing a lot of data, serving applications in the cloud, and making specific knowledge available on mobile. This is a long way from my schooling where I remember printing out a paper map and taping it to the wall for just three people to see. Along these lines, I recommend that you learn Python as a scripting environment where you can write routines needed to wrangle your data where it needs to be. Python is also used in the realm of data science to extract actionable knowledge out of your data. Learn a cloud environment like AWS or GCP made by Google. You'll control the serving of maps to large audiences. Think Johns Hopkins COVID map dashboard. You could also put yourself in a position to create interactive web applications by learning some of the web app authoring tools by Esri or Mapbox. All right, so now for some good news. You can learn anything you want to. I saw a high school student the other day and on his LinkedIn profile, he had a hackathon and three micro credentials under his belt. Take these short courses from Bootcamp GIS, Coursera, LinkedIn Learning, or Esri. But remember that GIS overlaps with a lot of other technology. So don't restrict yourself to a single piece of GIS software. As GIS analysts, we're used to wearing many hats. So if you branch out further, your killer portfolio will allow you to move up the pay scale.